We have continuing coverage now of a shooting overnight involving a Buncombe County deputy. Shots were fired after a deputy arrived on the scene of a domestic disturbance. It happened about 3 o'clock this morning in the Fairview community at a home on Laurel Loop Road. News 13's Mario Boone is streaming live for us from the Buncombe County Jail. What is the latest on the investigation, Mario? Well, 31-year-old Garrett Hatch is alive tonight after getting shot at by cops. He's also locked up in the Buncombe Jail here behind me, accused of trying to run over a sheriff's deputy with a car. Garrett said he was a non-confrontational male. And the cop fired off three shots. Paul Mai describes waking up at 3 a.m. to a Buncombe Sheriff's deputy shooting at his friend and neighbor, 31-year-old Garrett Hatch. It was just bam, 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 three quick shots. The shots rang out after a domestic violence call to 911 by Hatch's girlfriend from this home on Laurel Loop Road in Fairview. Deputies say Hatch drove at them aggressively down this narrow dirt road, forcing them to fire off several shots at the man. But his friends tell me a dramatically different story. Did you hear or see a car charging at a deputy? No, sir. Nikki Mai claims Hatch's car isn't even drivable. It's been stuck in a ditch for two days. So what do you think about the, the story that he tried to run over the deputies? Then it's not true. The violence seems routine for this neighbor. It don't surprise me on this hill, really. It don't. <laughs> There's, there's police in and out of here all the time. Who did what is now up to the SBI to figure out. The agency taking over the investigation, which is standard for officer-involved shootings. Also standard, the cop who fired the shots is off the streets temporarily. Pending the preliminary results from the SBI investigation. And again, Garrett locked up tonight, charged with one count each of DWI and assault with a deadly weapon on a government official. His bond is set at $50,000. We're live tonight outside the jail in downtown Asheville. I'm Mario Boone, News 13.